Hi everyone, I'm Ariana, and today's Zodiac Slime session is all about putting together several different elements that make every season so special. And we're gonna do that with a slime called Diamonds on Fire. So what do diamonds and fire have in common? We're gonna answer this question and more right now. So why don't we say we um, light up a spark and get the flames ignited, shall we? tuning in and welcome so we're gonna get started and don't worry if you hear any um, sounds outside my window it's just some um, traffic or anything like that but we'll see how far we can go without hearing anything in the back but otherwise just focus in on this gorgeous new session where we're going to be focusing on two different things that make every season very special. So, as I've mentioned before, Eris is one of three fire signs and the other two signs that are associated with the fire element are Leo and Sagittarius. So if you're born in either one of those um, seasons, you would know that your element is fire. And of course, fire is very hot and can actually create some heat. And it's also about energy and strength and power. So that's one thing. Another thing is if you're born in the month of April, you would know that your birthstone is the diamond. And as everyone knows, diamonds are a girl's best friend, but they're a lot more than just a girl's best friend. They also can create a sense of unity, grace, and beauty. And this slime, which was part of Sluru Institute's um, Crushed Gem series, they actually took diamonds and set them on fire so as you can see with this beautiful avalanche slime called diamonds on fire you're gonna see why so basically it's an avalanche slime and it's a mix of a slushy slime with pieces of silver sugar paper to represent the diamonds and red bean soup beads to represent the fire element. And hence the fact that it says diamonds on fire, it should definitely smell like red hot candies. And it definitely smells a lot like it, but it's not as, it's not overpowering. So if you feel that this slime, as I'm gonna get into right now, if you have the slime, take it out. Otherwise, no worries, just listen in. It's gonna feel a little sticky or tacky at first, so you might wanna use some activator like I just did right here. So, this slime is obviously something very special for those who are born in Aries or, or the other two fire signs or are born in the month and or in the month of April. So if this kind of like relates to you, then that's gonna be something very special here. So as I've mentioned before, diamonds create grace and beauty and <laughs> here are some uh, cars going on outside. <laughs> but <laughs> Don't worry about that. Diamonds are a very special piece of crystal that represents grace, unity, and beauty. And this slime also creates 
that perfect balance of energy, strength, and power within the fire element that is represented within the Binsu beads and the red hot candy scent. So how do you create this balance within those two special elements? Between the two, what does that really mean to you? In other words, how can you create this balance of energy and grace, strength and power and unity and beauty from within? And I really love the fact that this slime is makes that perfect balance of those elements because it really it really sparks an ignition that allows us to look more deeper, look more inward. And you you may realize that being beautiful is one of the many great strengths that anyone could ever have in their lives. And that's just really something that, that when it comes to meditating with a crystal or meditating um, on elements that, that spark interest from within, it's, it's something very special that anyone can relate to here. I'm into yoga and meditation. Sometimes I meditate with crystals. And the fact that diamonds can be associated with um, crystal healing and elements like fire being one of those four elements can be associated with astrology. It really creates that true inner space from all that is to say about it. So how can that be possible for you? How can you, like, what ignites your fire? What signifies your inner grace and beauty from within? Take that moment to think about those questions and further beyond them. Beautiful. And it's not really that sticky now because of the activator. So I'm going to leave everyone here with how you can create that power, that energy as well as that balance of that inner unity, grace, and beauty from within with, I always can really seem to come up with original quotes because I really don't know how I would be able to begin with it. But one thing that I can tell you as we bring our hands together and we'll take our last final deep breaths in together one original thing that I can um, leave you guys with is energy and power is one of the most graceful and beautiful things that one could live as long as they look into their own strength and ignite that spark to rise further and more beyond their wildest capacity. Thank you to Sumo Institute for sending in the Aries box and for everyone that's tuning in right now, gonna leave you all with our final breath in. And as I let you go and we bow to each other, just wanna say you're all beautiful and you're all powerful from the inside out and I 
hats off to you for that and keep saying that fire within you and showing how strong you all can really be as well take good care everyone namaste